If it's not the sound of construction that signals progress, maybe it's the smell of paint. Met Park is already well on its way to opening up this summer. Starting May 8th, District Dogs on South Each Street is one of the first businesses set to open at Metropolitan Park. Weeks before Amazon HQ2's first phase at National Landing in Arlington is scheduled to open in June. Having more than 8,000 employees coming here day in and day out to Met Park is going to increase the excitement and increase the foot traffic far beyond just our employees. The foot traffic is going to come. Uh, we are not worried about it. Among the retailers that have signed on is Toby's Ice Cream, hoping to open in June. The owners are banking on the new location and Amazon's mission to include women-owned and minority-owned businesses. Actually gives us uh, more exposure for our business. Uh, being a small business, we really um, appreciate Amazon's help. And then there's DC's Takaria Sochi's partner, Geraldine Mendoza, hoping to open in August, making this her first location with a full-time bar and seating area. We have a lot of ice competition, so I think those are going to be great to work with them. Uh, the only concern will be the high volume. It's a little bit different. Met Park is going through its final touches. It first broke ground in 2020. The multi-million dollar project has two 22-story office towers a public park and 55,000 square feet of retail space. It's here where the Museum of Contemporary Art Arlington is going to open an innovation studio. I think everyone uh, on our team and our board is going to be thrilled to be here. In the middle of a transforming landscape in Arlington. What we want to do is inspire people to pursue their own creativity. Like other businesses, this executive director hopes to find its place in the new community. Matthew Torres, WUSA 9.